Dean, into the second round of the FA Cup, you must be delighted. I'm buzzing, I have to be honest, I'm absolutely buzzing, excuse the pun. Um, our supporters come up here today, the team, the togetherness, the players, how good were our players today? You know, all the elements against, against us, full credit to course, and they had a real goal when we went down to 10 men. But I thought our organisation was excellent, Laurie made saves when he had to. Um, Danny Collins, come on, was immense. And um, I think they're sending off, you know, the force one's not even a yellow card. I don't even think it's a foul, he's got the ball. And he's giving me a yellow card. Um, yeah, look, it is what it is. And the second one is a yellow card all day long, but I think he, he could let it breathe a little bit. It was his fourth challenge. I think it was our fourth foul and he gave a yellow card, so that's down to Gaz, really, what he wants to do. But uh, Just on that red card, uh, obviously it was Connor Stevens' debut today. He had an injury over the summer. He had a little loan spell, so it's sort of his first time back into into football. Do you think there was just a bit of rustiness with the, the challenges at all, or the yellow cards? Or just... yellow card. It's a clean tackle. I thought Connor was outstanding. I thought he was absolutely immense in his performance. Obviously, he makes a slight error for the second, has a little nibble at him. The lad's rolling around the floor like he's got shot dead. No, I mean, he's rolling around like someone's just shot him. Listen, they Linux, they got some experienced players. They had a lot of gamesmanship in their game. The only thing I'm a little bit disappointed is when we were totally dominating with 11 men, we didn't go 2-3. And that's what you have to do here. But you always get drama in the cup. And uh, the main thing for us is we're into the, we're into the uh, second round draw. You've already touched on uh, Darling Collins' second half per, uh, second half performance today. Obviously, you brought him and Cropper on at half time. Was that just to add a bit of experience in the defence going to that second half? I didn't want to play Danny as long today. Um, he was meant to play. Connor was meant to play an hour, and Danny was meant to play six, uh, 20 minutes. But we can't pick and choose what we do. We had to get him on. Crops, he was on. Obviously, he played a little bit too long as well because of our injury situations. We've got to sort. All our injuries are muscle injuries, so we've got to sort this out. Uh, we've got to get to the bottom of it. Um, Obviously, the volume of games, but you know, I think Jay needs a little bit of help on it. I've got to be honest with you. Um, so, look, it is what it is. We're going to have to solve it. I'm going to have to solve it. Sit down with the chairman and sort it out. Um, but just on the lads' performance, it was outstanding performance. What about our goal? How good was that? How many passes was that goal? We must have put together at least 15 passes and then found on the back post. It was a great goal. So, yeah, great performance and brilliant to be in there. Into the draw. You just touched on uh, Nicky's goal there. Mm -hmm. Obviously, uh, 11 in the league. That's now his fourth in the FA Cup. He's having an excellent start to the season. How, how, what are your thoughts so far? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been brilliant, Nicky. Obviously, he scored again in the six-yard box. I keep telling them, get in that six-yard box and on that back post as much as you can. Keep walking with him on it. And obviously, we transformed the player who, obviously, before he come here, didn't score a lot of goals. Uh, he ran the channels a lot. And I've just basically, I see something in the kid. And if he keeps going in the right positions, he'll score more goals. So. I'm delighted for him because he's a great kid and he's got a great attitude. And then another player who I thought performed really well in that second half, Laurie Walker, some excellent saves from him to keep the clean sheet. Yeah, look, he made he made a brilliant save from a volley, from a dipping volley, which was unbelievable save. And to be fair to them, they put in some great crosses. His handling from cross was excellent. And he was a star, one of the star players today. He's definitely stepped up to the plate. He's done that in the last two games. And that's what you need, just to win the month. It's, you know, it's, it's quite windy here today, it's wet. I thought that pitch played excellent. Um, full credit to uh, the, the ground staff there. Uh, the pitch was outstanding, to be honest with you. Um, and Laurier, yeah, great performance. His handling from crosses was really good. He relieved a lot of pressure from a few crosses. Um, we did a little bit of luck with a couple of decisions that were given offside. They scored from, uh, but if they're offside, they're offside. But I put that down to good defending. We obviously squeezed the box well. Um, so, yeah, look, great performance from Laurie. Great performance from everybody. Everybody that played a part. Everyone here, even the lads that didn't go on, the togetherness with Sean was outstanding. Obviously now an, an, a really big week for the club, the big game against Chesterfield on Saturday, we've got the Middlesex game as well on the Tuesday, how's this next week going to look for the group? Yeah, the Middlesex game, we'll have to play some players in that game because they need some fitness, um, the ones that have been injured, so yeah, a busy week, really busy week, um, and a huge game next week, obviously, it's not, it's not a defining game or anything like that, but it's the games you want to be involved in, you know, when I first come to this football club, we're involved in relegation games. Only 23 months ago, was a bit little, little longer, was it? Probably 25 months ago, 26 months ago, and we've managed to turn the football club around. And these are the games we want to be involved in. We're a great club, great team, uh, Cookie top manager, and they've got a big game tomorrow against Portsmouth. I wish them well in it. I hope they represent the National League well. I hope they can get into the into the second round as well. So, um, yeah, really good game. We're we're looking forward to it. Dean, congratulations. Thank you for your time. Cheers, lads. God bless.